Welcome back to my channel. My name is Chromozo Ramano. For those of you who don't know me, if you're new here, hi, welcome. Do click that subscribe button down below to become a part of this family. And if you're returning, thank you so much for your continuous support. I really do appreciate it. As you might tell by the title of today's video, we will be vlogging. It is a Saturday and I'm thinking of actually cooking because a friend of mine is coming over so i just want to make sure that when she gets here we don't buy takeaways and all of that um i'm just gonna you know dish up and all of that i'm gonna make a uh, boneless skinless chicken thigh um curry with some basmati rice i actually forgot to buy some drinks like um juice and all of that but um that's not a big thing i can just go out and buy it so i'm gonna start cooking now and i thought i should just take you guys along you know how it is i know you guys enjoy cooking segments on my videos so we're gonna cook right now and then i'll go buy juice once i'm done she should get here at about um she said she's gonna leave at three so maybe let's say five or six latest and then the guy who's also doing our um, 
bedroom glass cabinets said he's gonna come here at three it is currently two o'clock so i hope he's gonna be here on time i don't want him drilling and doing all of that stuff making a noise when i've got a visitor so hopefully he keeps to his promise to come here at three because he was he was supposed to come last week on wednesday it is saturday he's still not here but yeah i just hope he's gonna come here today so yeah guys let's get on with cooking
know what it is you do. I just want you. I just need you. I know what it is you do. I just want to love you. I just want to hold you. just want to be with you till we grow old. Just tell me you'll stay or take me away. I want you for myself every single day. You set my world on fire. You set my world on fire. You guys, I'm done cooking. Guess what? Let me show you. Show me what it's like to be circling among the clouds. Because without you by my side, I would be stuck here on the ground. You're lighting up the way I can see the road ahead of me. I won't be stumbling in the dark Your eyes are shining like the stars I was down Until you saved me Until you set me free My eyes were closed Now I see clear as day And I just wanted to say That you can take me high Feels like I can fly can take me high I can see the sun staring at you when you make that smile I'm moving closer to you now I can't get close enough somehow and I was down until you saved me until you set me free my eyes were closed now I see clear as day And I just wanted to say That you can take me high Feels like I can fly I don't need anybody I don't need anybody else No one will ever take me No one will ever take me away I promise I will hold on to you I don't know what I'd do Without you mm. Without you You can take me high Feels like I can fly Take me high Feels like I can fly You can take me high Hey guys, everything has literally been going on and I haven't been explaining anything First of all, um, I'm done cooking. I'll show you once I dish up and once my friend gets here. Secondly, we got our, um, well, I got my closet doors, gloss ones. I think it looks really nice. Third of all, we put the rug in here. I think it looks nice. I'm gonna show that to you. And then, right now I'm just gonna chill. The baby's sleeping. I'm just gonna chill and then dish up when um, my friend gets here. And yeah, let me show you what the rug looks like in the dining room. I think it looks super cute. It looks very nice. I was doubting the gray, but it actually fits in. So you can tell that the rug has been in storage, like in a tight plastic for quite some time. This is what it looks like underneath the table. I think it looks, I think it looks good, guys. I think it really looks good. And it just fits, not perfectly, but it fits. That's all that matters. I don't know maybe I should get a bigger one even for the um, lounge area I need a huge rug there's a subby that um, suggested a place where I can get like 
bigger rugs so i think that's where i'm gonna buy new ones but for now this one will have to do i'm just gonna put the these back on the table and as you can see i'm done cooking it looks good so yeah let's put these back on the table anyway guys i think you did see this um as a little sneak peek so we got this high chair from maneo she bought it for kumo and i am in love i love that it is gold and white definitely fits with the aesthetic of this house it's so it's so cute and she's already sitting here today we put her on the floor and she literally sat on her own so i think this is going to come in very handy. She loves sitting here, especially when I'm cooking and she watches me. She doesn't really cry as compared to when we put her on the couch, like lying down. I think she gets tired of lying down. So we got this high chair. Super happy for it. Thank you so much to Maneo for getting us this. I didn't know that I needed this. I didn't know that we've got like um, such aesthetically pleasing high chairs. But yeah, this is a chair, guys super in love i need to go throw that plastic bag away because the rug is out now hey guys it is another day and it's a bit dark here let me move away so it is another day my friend just left i didn't vlog at all recently when i've got like friends over i don't vlog i think i enjoy their company so much that i feel i don't feel the need to take out the camera anyway she bought me some roses they look so lovely they look so lovely we are currently in oops we are currently in load shedding i can't even watch tv and i'm so bored it's just me and the kids so yeah um i'm also uploading today's vlog um it's so dark here anyway i'm uploading today's vlog and my battery is gonna die and we have load shedding yeah let me turn around we've got um load shedding we've got load shedding until four i don't think i'm gonna be able to upload the vlog early i guess it's gonna be late but you guys will understand as long as the video is up on sunday guys that's all that matters so um i want to just upload this video but i think i'm not gonna do it it did um i saved it to my uh laptop because it was on imovie i exported it so it's done exporting i just have to put it onto youtube but i think i'll do that after um load shedding at like half past four and then it should be up in two hours i don't have fiber i've got wi-fi so it takes a while so yeah i'm gonna upload it later right now i just want to go and show you guys the closet doors it's just that the closet is dark um it does not have windows you guys know um the only place that has got windows is my bathroom and my bedroom so the closet is in between so you guys won't really see so i think i'm also going to wait for the lights to come back so i can show it to you guys it looks so nice i still haven't cleaned it i'm lazy guys my helper's not in today it's her birthday so I guess she'll clean it tomorrow i'm not gonna do it i'm too lazy anyway i also want to go to the bedroom quickly and just do a haul for you guys because he's calling me i'll see you just now so yeah. y'all i'm in the bedroom the baby just woke up that's why crazy was screaming my name anyway i'm going to show you the stuff that i got from fushini i'm just going to lay them on the bed and show them to you i don't want to do like a talking and showing you because i tend to ramble and i get bored when i edit those parts so i'm just going to show you what i got at fushini for like autumn winter fushini has come through for the girls you guys they've got such lovely pieces i'm going to show you that and then i need to just feed the baby because she just woke up um i think i'm gonna catch you guys later also i just want to put my my roses in a vase before they die so yeah let me do that okay you guys i'm gonna show you all these things but first i want to say i placed another order online these i got in store because i there was like a buy one get the cheapest one off um like the cheapest one free so i couldn't help but buy a lot of stuff i'm so happy with fashini guys i think i'm no longer gonna buy from zara anymore honestly because zara is super 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 expensive anyway this is the first shirt that i bought it is in a size small it was um 3.99 i love it i mean i also saw these loafers i'm not too sure about them i don't know if i like the shape here in front that it's a square but i think i like them i'm just not too sure and these were 
also got this um, olive jacket. Love, love, love it. I went crazy over it when I saw it. It looks really warm. So yeah, this was this was quite pricey. And this is an in a 2XS. I think I wanted to take an extra small. I made a mistake. It was $6.99. I'll have to take this back. I'm gonna fit it quickly. If it's too small, I'm gonna take it back. And then I bought this striped black and white jersey. These are in right now. And this was $4.29. And then I just bought a classic white shirt um, in a size small. It was $3.79. So happy with um, all these items, guys. Can't wait until my next order gets here. I'll do a haul once they get here. Moments later. You guys, my day today was just so messed up. So I leave the house. I want to go buy some cake for my helper because it's her birthday. And you know what happens? Just as I'm about to get to Woody's, I get into a pothole, like a huge pothole. Thing is, um, where the pothole was, it was like it's like an alley. So there's trees and there's shadows. So I didn't even see that there's like a pothole, and I went straight into it. And that time, I'm rushing to get to Woolies before they close. Um, so I had to like park my car at Roko Mama's and then call my insurance. So they organized a tow truck for me, and then we quickly walked to Woolies with Crazy because it's like just like a walking distance. Got the cake, went back, and I literally didn't even wait that long, guys. I'm super happy with my insurance. Like I'm. I'm not complaining my premium went like lower this year and they were able to send a tow truck at no cost and no excess nothing i was so happy guys like i was almost stressed i still need to buy a new tire and run flats don't come cheap but yeah i'm just glad i didn't pay for the tow truck so i thought i should just let you guys know um it is quite late now i think i'm just gonna close off the vlog here for today and i'll see you guys tomorrow so loves, this is what this door looks like. I actually love it so much. I'm even thinking of getting um, glass doors all the way around, except for the shoes, of course. So yeah, I really love it. I also need to color code my things. I tried, but it's not so color coded. I'm also going to remove t-shirts t-shirts up there because we are going into winter. also want to put in a basket that looks exactly like 
that one there instead of like that um, cream one and my jerseys are up there those are going to stay there but I'm just going to put more winter stuff remove all my dresses put them in the drawers as well as my jeans they need to go into the chest of drawers and they need to be folded so yeah I really like it and let me just open it so you guys can see so it's got like one handle on this side so my bags are protected from dust and all of that and yeah so it is also a soft close yeah and that one as well you guys I love it I love it so much it's so beautiful zamunda really does do a good job again i'm gonna link his number at the bottom of the screen um so if you want to utilize his services and do so he's really good also he's going to be doing our mirror let me turn the camera around. um i'm quite a mess but anyway i was saying he's also going to do the mirror wall that i asked you guys about um i haven't seen suggestions yet because the video went up today but if you did suggest a thank you so much but Zamunda is the one that's going to do our wall. Really love his work. He's very particular and he is very neat in everything that um, he does. So I think I'm going to just ask him to do it for us. He said he can do it. So I guess he's going to do it. Anyway, guys, it is um, late now. I think we're going to go sleep. I'm just going to go get um, the baby from the other side I was eating. <laughs> I'm going to go get the baby from the other side, bring her to the bedroom so we can sleep and call it a night tomorrow is another day it is a monday i'm also going to work so i guess i'll see you guys when i get back from work It is a couple of days later and I'm just so glad that my Fushini order actually got here before I could end off this vlog <clears throat> because I'm looking at the footage and I feel like I want to end this vlog. So I'm just going to show you what I got um, from Fushini. I think I'm done shopping for winter and yesterday I took out 24 jeans you guys and I'm left with like 18 that I know I usually wear even though some of them I don't wear a lot. I know that I've got like four or five jeans that I wear quite a lot only because i had so many that they overwhelmed overwhelmed me and i couldn't really see which jeans i've got so now it's going to be so much better i'm going to take them out i'm not selling them guys people are weird out there so i'm just not going to sell them i'm going to just give them to family members and i already know who so please don't ask for them i know who i'm going to give them to so that's what i'm going to do i want to transition my clothing stuff like to winter i've got a lot of um closet space to be honest but i feel like I'm just going to put my summer clothes where I don't normally reach. Um, and then I'm going to put my winter autumn clothes where I am, like where I normally reach when I'm um, taking out clothes. So let me show you the Fushini stuff. And I also bought some stuff on H&M um, slash Superbalist online. Um, it is home stuff. And I'm also excited for that. I think let's start with the Superbalist um, slash H&M package. And then we'll do the Fushini. And then I'm going to start um, switching my closet for my winter clothes. I'm just going to pack my jeans in my chest of drawers. I think it's better that way than to have them folded. Because it's not easy to see them. So in my chest of drawers it will be easier. And then I'm going to go get my vacuum bags. Um, take out my coats. Hang them. And take out like little t-shirts camisoles and shorts and all of that put them in vacuum sealer bags and vacuum them even though i've got space i don't want things cramped up i think it's better to have them in vacuum sealer bags and in the guest bedroom or in a suitcase so that's what we're gonna do let me show you the stuff that i got so this is the packaging as you can see it says super belize slash h and m um so i've got like a fur blanket already saw this one from h and m and i really loved it it is quite um small not really small but it's like smaller than the one that i have and on the inside it doesn't feel warm it looks like i don't know if you felt like scrubs that um like healthcare professionals wear i feel like this feels like a scrub but it's okay because i'm just going to decorate with it i think i'm going to take this to the um, living room to put it on the couch because it's less 
it's less busy and it's smaller i'll decorate with this one and then the bigger one is going to come to my bedroom because it is winter now so yeah and then i did open it already guys that's why there's a mess in here i wanted to save everything to show you what i got and then i bought some i'll show you this one because i bought two i bought these um serviette holders like for when i'm when I'm hosting or like on the dining table, I think this would be really nice. It's a nice gold. Um, I love it. I bought two. And then I also got some spoons. I think these are going to go in my coffee, like on my coffee station instead of like using normal spoons. I bought like nine. I felt like six was going to be an odd number. So I added another pack, even though nine is still a odd number, but it's better if like they get lost or whatever because my spoons tend to grow legs i also went to this chem the other day i threw everything in this box literally also went to this chem the other day so i got my eye drops those are not important i got um a serum a hydro the hydro boost serum by neutrogena it is the hyaluronic acid one i want to use three serums i researched um skincare and i do follow some dermatologists on instagram and they suggest that you keep your serums to three but not more than three so i'm going to use hyaluronic acid i'm going to use niacinamide that's in my fancy skin one and i'm also going to use metrixil is it metrixil okay let me show you which one first uh, I'm going to use this one here by Skin Republic. It is Metrixil 3010%. So this is like an anti-aging serum and like it produces collagen if i'm not mistaken i forgot guys it says here skin age visibly reduced by 1.8 years so i can't wait to use this i'm gonna change my serums up um every time um they are finished and rotate um within the ones that treat me well so yeah last but not least i got this um hydrating cream facial moisturizing lotion <laughs> sorry i was trying to actually um <laughs> Translate this, my goodness, for Moto. So I bought this facial moisturizing lotion by Sarah V. I want to use, I can also use two moisturize, moisturizing lotions. I felt like the Hydro Boost is fine in summer, but in winter, I'm going to have to like put two moisturizers, which is also acceptable. You start by using the lighter one and then you go for the heavier one. This one is quite heavy. I'm not really heavy, but moisturizing and thicker. So I'm going to put my Hydro Boost one on first, then follow with this one. So that's about it, guys. I'm going to show you the stuff that I got from Foshini now. Please don't mind my bed, but I thought I'm going to put you guys on the tripod. I think it's easier that way to show you stuff. Um, I hope I'm not going to... I just hope I'm not going to take too long talking about stuff. So this is the size of this um, fur blanket throw thing from H&M. And now I'm um, from Foshini Online. I did open it. I did open it already, guys. I'm impatient like that. So I bought a pleated black skirt. I've got literally all colors in the skirt. I love it so much. So yeah, I got it again. It's just like the belted pants. I've got belted pants from Zara in every color, in almost every color. Then I got this shirt from Luella. I love it. I love how the buttons look here. Sorry about that. I ran out of space, but I'll show you guys the buttons of this top. And it also has the same buttons on the back. Um, I'm definitely going to rock this with like a plain black bra underneath. And then the next thing that I got, there was like a buy one, get one free, like cheapest one free. So I was so happy for that. This was one of the things that I got for free. It, it is this like jersey crop top with like a nice neck it is by the brand yng this one was about 3.99 got it for free and yeah it's long sleeved got it in a size small or extra, extra small and then i also got this these pajamas for free like after purchasing everything that i purchased i love the color it's like a sage green kind of um, color and this is what the sleeves look like it is a button down this was 3.59 the pants were 2.59 and i got both in a size small because i've gained a lot of weight my jeans like all 18 of the ones all 20 of the ones that i actually took out don't fit me anymore so yeah this is what the pants look like and the bottom just looks like that Super excited for these. They feel warm as well. And last but not least, 
I got a coat, like a green coat. I want to color block this winter. I couldn't do it last year because I was hiding it from you guys that I'm pregnant. So I was not posting a lot of pictures on Instagram. I was not dressing up. So this winter I'm determined to look good every single day. Well, I'm going to try. So this is a coat that I got. This is the color. It's got pockets on the sides. It's double breasted. I love it. And I got this in a size extra small. It was $8.59. So yeah, those are the things that I got you guys. Um, yeah, I think we are done. Let me show you the jeans that I took out so that we can pack them in the chest of drawers. And I also removed my roses the other day. And I put that um, orchid there. Because a lot of you suggested that I remove it from the... Um, console server on that side and bring it like and remove it just remove it that side and I decided to put it in the bedroom and yeah guys let's start packing so I can go get my other winter stuff it's so hot in here yo so I can go get my other stuff and start packing and switching over and all of that good stuff we're gonna start with the jeans so these are literally all the jeans that I was telling you guys about these ones um I'm gonna give to my cousins um, I don't like them anymore, but they still look good. These ones over here still basically all have tags, but they just don't fit me. I was thinking of selling them on Yaga, but I'm not going to do that. Um, and then, and these are the ones that I'm hoping will still fit me if I lose weight, like if a miracle happens. I don't want to lose weight, but I'm going to keep four of these just in case. Those ones I'm also giving away. They do have price tags, most of them. These ones that are rolled like this, this pile here and that one there, I am going to put in my chest of drawers. Those are the jeans that I usually wear. Super proud of myself that I don't have a lot of clothes anymore. So I'm going to take them to that side so we can pick them. It's not my fault You've been lying saying that I took away your peace Drowning by yourself, now you wanna blame me Like you have no options I take your options Now I'm not the problem Man, that's on you, yeah You've been terrorizing me, yeah, I'm always wrong. I knew you lost your mind when you dropped that bomb. Girl, are you crazy? Yeah, you must be crazy. I've been thinking lately, lately it's you. You stole your peace, put it on me. the clothes that were there as well the camera cut me off i had to change batteries so yeah that's what we're looking like and i also want to declutter my shoes down here let me show you down here because i don't wear them anymore i need to make this closet look nice guys it's a whole mess i keep saying this but i never fix it so i want to those shoes on that top row most of them i'm not wearing i'm just going to keep my air force and um those pink ones for gym and those two i think i'll still keep them but i don't want them there 
um, I think I'm gonna put them in this round ottoman because there's nothing in there. I decluttered it. I decluttered it, so I might put all my shoes in there. And yeah, let me just sort out these clothes that I threw on the floor here. Um, ones that I'm giving away, the ones that I'm keeping, and the ones that are for summer, and the ones that I can still wear in winter. Yeah, me sit down to the girl, my life be like, yo. Never look in a year, the book, I'll take the kind of year for you. The fishing in an under, so can store her by my side, oh, why? So the two rap put it for me, or the other baby. For them, hey, yard is yard is. Don't be your bother on the rocks. Men do effect of only. But they are legged on me, too. You will hardly, hardly, hardly. For me, share my safety. It is later on in the evening. Um, literally back where I was before we left. Um, we went to Mozambique to have some dinner and also just to take Kwezi out because she actually presented in front of the class and I know her to be very shy. She's not really shy, but like I know in front of people, she is not so comfortable speaking in front of crowds. So yeah, we thought we just um, gonna take her out because we promised to like surprise her with something and i know she really loves going to like places where there's like um like a play area so we took her there right now i did change as you can see i was wearing a, a nudish brownish dress um so i had to change to a long sleeve and like some jeans so that i could be warm i didn't vlog much at mozambique but you guys would have seen what i had um so yeah i want to wear pajamas now and carry on it is a mess in here i'm gonna wear my new pajamas <coughs> Excuse me. I'm going to wear my new pajamas um, that I showed you today from Fushini and then carry on. And then in about an hour or two, I'm going to go get the baby um, in the nursery so she can come sleep in the bedroom. And then um, I'm going to close up this vlog here for today. Tomorrow is a full day at work. So I guess I'm going to see you guys on Friday or Saturday. Um, we'll see. So let me just get into my pajamas um, and sort out this mess. I actually like these pajamas. You guys are gonna think I'm obsessed with this color, and I'm not. It's just that I'm finding a lot of nice things in this color. Like my bedding is this color. But anyway, let me show you how this, how these pajamas look. I'm glad I took a small instead of an extra small because it's gonna, it was gonna be too tight. So yeah, let me show you. So guys, these are the pajamas. They've got a bit of static, as you can see, but I like them. I like this that's going on here. It's not meant to go all the way to my like wrist, but I like it. They are static, so they are sticking to my... I don't know if you guys can see, but yeah, I didn't even wash them. I know some of you guys are going to ask me why I didn't wash them before I wore them, but yeah, that's what they look like. I'm just going to pick up the mess. These are all the clothes that... um. No longer wearing these. I need to take out these are like winter clothes. I'll see which ones I don't wanna wear anymore and take them out. Most of these in here I'm not gonna wear anymore, so I think they're gonna have to go out, as well as the ones in here. And then, ah, oh, there's a mess all over, guys. Don't mind it. 
and then in here shoes everywhere anyway i'm also getting rid of those shoes i don't like them never worn them so these are all my summer t-shirts dresses and all of that this is a dress that i was wearing you guys i just threw it on the floor i'm gonna put it in the washing um so yeah i'm gonna just vacuum seal these bags after i take out the clothes in that corner there um jerseys are already in i need to take out those two baskets and sort out that corner up there as well as the skirts and pants there so yeah let's do that I'm done with that bag over there. I'm just going to vacuum seal it tomorrow. And then, as you can see, my coats. Let me just pan you guys up. I don't love the different lengths there. So I think I'm just going to do the long coats um, on that side and the short ones here. I need to add another rail at the bottom. I think I'm going to do that very soon so all my short jackets can go there. Uh, and then in summer, all my t-shirts and shirts go there. So there's usually space at the bottom, which I don't like. So I think I'm going to do that. Then my long coats, I'm just going to transfer them to that side. They are so wrinkled because um, they were in vacuum sealer bags. But yeah, and then the ones on that, the clothes on that, um, on the stair, the clothes on that step thingy, uh, summer clothes, they didn't all fit in the vacuum bag. Um, so I'm going to put them in the other vacuum bag. Once I'm done there, I'm going to go to sleep. I'll continue tomorrow. This is taking way longer than I had expected. So guys, as I said, I made a lot of progress except for the other spaces. And on these um, empty shelves, I, I haven't organized that. I don't know what's going to go there, but I put one basket there and it looks decent. But... I am bothered by that space on the top so I'll sort that out later on the bottom there I just threw in all my shoes and then the coats I made a lot of progress but I realized that I don't want my long coats sitting there so I'm going to move my shorter ones to that corner there and the longer ones sorry to that um, area there because they are short in length I'm going to put them here and then my jerseys up there are in order i love how they look i color coordinated them there's also still some space so if i want to purchase new things they will fit and then there at the top i need to remove those jerseys there and add them there because there is space and then here i've got tracks with tops and bottoms that are the same um colors as you can see we've got like an um sage We've got like an olive, sage green, and then white and beige, even at the top so they match, as well as on that side. And then up there, I've got like um, tracksuit tops that don't match, as well as tracksuit, no, it's actually tracksuit pants. Tracksuit tops are up there. And then that area there, I left it as is. I still need to add more stuff there, and then I need to, you know, get that place in order. Put all my winter knit dresses that are short over there and yeah we are gonna be done i think so far so good this is the progress at the moment um i'm not gonna show it to you guys again unless if you see it in one of my vlogs so um i think i'm done here 
so guys we have come to the end of this video i'm so sorry i'm ending this vlog like this but anyway i have to do what i have to do um thank you guys so much for watching until this far please don't forget to like comment and subscribe also please leave some roses in the comment section below just to show me that you've watched until the end i would really appreciate that guys thank you once again for watching um i truly appreciate your support i'll see you again in another video bye loves Thank you.